In 2018, Skino Katsura Iwai took the gold prize at a Japanese sake competition held in France. In fact, this is no ordinary sake. It's made from a phantom rice, which all but disappeared 50 years ago. The yield is only about 60% that of ordinary rice. The sake is made using this rare rice grown only in Kyoto. What's the secret behind its flavor? One of Japan's best sake brewery districts, Fushimi in Kyoto. This is where you'll find Masada Tokubei Shoten. As one of Fushimi's oldest breweries, it's been guarding its traditions for over 300 years. It's said to be the first brewery to produce both nigori sake and koshu, which undergoes lengthy aging. This is one of the brewery's representative sakes, Tsukino Katsura Iwai. One of its characteristic traits is the use of phantom sake rice. Why is it called phantom? Actually, this Iwai Mai rice was cultivated in Kyoto until about 50 years ago. Difficult to grow, it all but disappeared from the market in the following years. The stalks are too tall for mechanical cultivation. Also, the yield is lower than ordinary rice. With farmers unwilling to grow it, the rice vanished for a time. But breweries in Fushimi wanted Iwaimai rice to be revived, and research was conducted on the remaining seed rice. In 1992, the variety was resurrected. But why use Iwai Mai rice that's so hard to grow? In fact, compared to other sake rice, Iwai Mai grains have a larger white core, richer in the high quality starches that are important for sake brewing. This rice has all the traits desirable to brewers and can be used to create superior sakes with a profound flavor profile. Also, the surface of rice contains components with bitter, unpleasant flavors. This part of the grain needs to be polished away. It's widely held that the more rice is polished, the better the sake. But with Tsukino Katsura Iwai, only 20% of the surface needs to be removed to release the rice's best flavor. Eh, 皆さんに大変喜んでいただけるんじゃないかなと思っています。